Hi, I'm here with um, Alexander Danilenko. Um, uh, Sasha, could you please show your uh, your badge so the people at home can see? Just take a quick look. All right. Um, so, uh, Sasha, where, where are you from and, and what are you doing here at World Water Week? Um, uh, my name is Alexander Danilenko, as we said now. I am in charge of International Benchmarking Network of Water Incendiation Utilities, which is the largest world database which collects and uh, displays uh, publicly information from uh, more than 3,100 utilities from more than 110 countries around the world. The objective of this database is to provide first-class, first-hand uh, information straight from the utilities to its consumers, authorities mm -hmm. and constituency to give a clear data, clear picture of utilities' performance, their needs, their difficulties and their uh, way to recover. Mm -hmm. uh, this is information being used for development of performance improvement plans of water utilities, development of new tariff systems, new investments and new investment programs to base not on outputs like kilometers of pipes but on outcomes related to increased coverage, increased water quality, increased uh, performance utilities and so on. Mm -hmm. so I mean, with all of this data, what, what's the most popular data hit that you guys have on, on of all the benchmarks? What is, what is what is the general public most interested to find out? Um, the most important uh, element, uh, uh, the uh, how to say it? no. Let's get back for one second. Um, there are few interested groups, and they interested in different outcomes. For example, for policy, for health purposes, mm -hmm. you more need coverage and consumption of water sector. Uh, for financial institutions, you need, uh, for example, uh, cost recovery, tariffs and costs. Mm -hmm. uh, for technical people, you need water losses, water consumption, water production and all other things. Mm -hmm. For politicians, you need water demand and how it can be matched. Right. So all of these things are different categories, have different interests. So that is why that's the most uh, difficult part of water business, because uh, that's a business which uh, which um, at the same time is a service. Right. So the service uh, uh, and our objective is to transform this uh, concept of water as a water service from uh, water service to a business that serves the public the best. So with combination of these indicators, uh, with analysis of all of them together, with all these multi-dimensional pictures of water utilities, you can get create a decent picture how utility operates and all the things. I can give a simple example which can be easy to get. It's like uh, what do you prefer? What do you do that covers 100% of the city and provides water only one hour a day? Or you want a utility which serves 10% of population that provides water 24 hours a day. That's a political decision which can be taken and addressed and then uh, converted into a kind of political mode that will achieve 24-7 for everyone. Yeah. And so that's, that's where we're starting and we're heading into that 